There are tons of different soaps and cleaners that you use on a daily basis. Or at least I hope so. There's hand soaps, body soaps, dish soaps, or maybe even hand sanitizer. So how does soap work? And what is it made of? It's actually a bit more complicated and a bit weirder than you might think. All soaps are molecules that are made up of two distinct parts, a salt head and a fatty acid tail. The salt head is hydrophilic, which means it loves water, and the tail is hydrophobic, which means it hates water with a passion. The tail also attracts oils, grease, bacteria, or even viruses. When you put soap on your hands, the fatty acid tails attract all the gunk that you want off your hands. Then, when you run water over your hands, the soap molecules form something called a micelle. The hydrophobic tails are trying to escape the water, which makes the soap molecules form a sphere around all of the gunk. The water then rinses the soap off of your hands, bringing all of the gunk with it. Contrary to popular belief, regular soap doesn't actually kill bacteria. It just rinses it off. Your next question is probably, what about antibacterials? Well, antibacterial soaps work because the soap manufacturers add chemicals that are known to kill bacteria. But there's a huge problem with antibacterial soaps. They don't work the way we use them. For most antibacterial soaps to work fully, you need to leave the soap on for up to two minutes. But most of us just aren't patient enough for that. This leads to most of the bacteria surviving and becoming resistant to these antibacterials. Research leads to the fact that antibacterial soaps just are not effective, and for the most part, they're actually pretty bad. Hand sanitizers, on the other hand, are actually pretty effective when you're low on time, or if you don't have any soap around. Use a 60-95% to alcohol-based hand sanitizer to kill the bacteria, but at the same time, don't trade a hand sanitizer for soap, because hand sanitizers do not remove the dirt and the oils. So what's the best way to wash your hands? Wash with warm water for at least 15 to 20 seconds with non-antibacterial soap. Hot water, surprisingly, does not really help kill bacteria with the amount that humans can handle, but does help wash the dirt and oils off a bit easier. It's that simple. Wash your hands before every meal and every time you use the bathroom. That includes number one, guys, because every time you use the bathroom, you don't know what you've touched that other people who have not washed their hands have touched. And that's all we're going to have for today, so as always, thanks for watching and have a great soap-filled life.